happy Monday. Last Monday of August. Oh. In honor of that, 10 minutes, all you need is a mount and a good cat at two. This is Mandy, by the way, in case you don't know who I am, Mandy Miller Fitness here on Patreon and of course on YouTube. So I hope you're following me there. If you're not, do. It'll be more than I promise. Um, we have a nice no repeats, no impact core activity. This will take us 10 minutes and I do have a playlist. If you want to use it, great. If not, also great. We're going to get really warm, just, just about a minute and a half long and then movements and then a little bit of a stretch. It's mostly just the work. So sorry, not sorry. All right. Okay. So let's go ahead and hit play on our playlist in three, two, one. And we're going to make our way over to our mat right away. Okay. Make sure I actually have started the hole. There we go. I hit it and then I hit it again. So that's what happens. Okay, okay. So come on down to your back. Place your feet flat. Take your arms directly over your chest. All I need for you to do is draw your ribs down and release. So close the back onto the mat and release the back off the mat. Exhale, close. Inhale to release. Last one. Exhale, close. Keep the close. Keep the arms over the chest. Start to march the legs. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift. Just starting to feel low belly engagement. Last one on the right. Last one on the left. Let's float the legs to table. Excellent. Let's bring those arms out wide. Good. Drop the knees right side. Back to the center. To the left side. Back to the center. Two more, over to the right. Keep those shoulders down, over to the left. I know, I do it too. Last one, knuckles down, palms up. Beautiful, and the other side. Beautiful, and then we're gonna extend those legs up and right to the sky. Squeeze those legs together, take the arms directly over the chest again. Curl the head, neck, and shoulders up, and release. Beautiful, up. Tuck your chin, you're looking at your inner thighs. Last one up, hold the lift. Rotate to the right, rotate to the left. Last one, or excuse me, both sides one more time. Over to the right, over to the left. Good, bring the knees into the chest, rock yourself up to sit in a butterfly formation. So my knees are wide. Take the arms forward, start to round the spine back and curl my way up. Okay, the real work is coming, friends. We're starting with a butterfly sit-up. We're gonna start in this exact same position, okay? So take the arms over the head, top position, roll yourself down all the way to your back. One full minute, curl my way up, reach up, soles of the feet meet. If for any reason this is just not working for your hips, keep your feet flat on the floor, full sit-ups there. Tuck your chin, try not to, you know, ricochet off of the mat. Feel each vertebrae make contact. Exhale to lift and inhale to release. We've got about half of a minute's time left. We won't see it again. So just give it your 100%. I'm pressing the soles of my feet together. Just really trying to target that abdominal wall. I like this too because it feels like a little bit of a hip opener for me. Good, we've got time for a couple more reps. Curl my way up and lower myself down. Okay, last one and then we're gonna meet on our backs here. Okay, place the hands next to the hips. Extend one foot, heel to the floor, other knee away from the chest. It's a figure four bridge and then a figure four curl to the side. So I've got that knee of the right lifted. I lift off the hips. I take the hands over the chest. I rotate over that side. Keep going, same side. Lift, release, palms together, rotate, release. Excellent, last one on this side because it's only half of a minute's time per side. I know, kind of a bummer. Let's switch the sides. Flexing through that foot, take those palms, rotate over that hip, return through center, plant the hands, lift the hips up. Good, keep going. Flex that foot, push that knee away from you. 
exhale up. Notice if those hips are moving around, shoulders are moving around. Curl and finish with the bridge here. Reverse curl. So take the legs directly to the sky. Let's point those toes. Try not to let the legs really extend back. I'm going to lift my hips and slow release. I can always lift my hips, catch them, and release back down. Lift my hips. Legs are working together. Head, neck, and shoulders stay down. Lift and release. Whew, I'm feeling this one. And release. Set that spine down with control. 30 seconds. Whew. Feeling the work for sure all along my abdominal wall. Exhale, lift. Less is more. Notice I'm not counting my reps here. It's all for a minute. So do what you can. Pause if you need to. Take breaks where needed. I feel this in my triceps too, so you're welcome. You have time for one more rep. Take an inhale, exhale, lift it. <sighs> inhale, slow release. Beautiful. From here, what is next? Okay. Right. Okay, come on down to your side plank forearm. Bottom knee is going to bend. This one is a full minute, we're not splitting it in half. So top leg is flexed. I'm gonna lift my way up and release back down. So lift my way up and release. So if I wanted to advance this movement for the remainder of the minute, I'm gonna take that top leg forward. Lift and release, I'm moving side plank today. Lift and release. If for any reason you're feeling this in that shoulder girdle in a weird kind of out of alignment way, you could always take your time, rest between each rep. Notice I'm taking my time. Beautiful, flip it around and reverse it. So I'll start with the modified variation with the knee bent, top arm reaching for the sky, lift and release. So with the knee bent, I'm actually getting the help of that leg to lift. Exhale, rise, keep that chest flush to the front, Inhale, release. Now, if I'm feeling this, bottom foot forward, lift the hips and release the hips back down. 30 more seconds. Whew. Excellent. Just find that little bit of hang time. Lift it up and release. Okay. We're going to be back on our backs here after this. Just a few more seconds with that nice little side bend, side plank nonsense. Lift up and release. Beautiful. Last two reps and release. Last rep and release. Lower down to your back. Okay, this one is static. It's going to be hard, but that's why we're here. So press down through the arms, press down through the heels, snuggle the shoulders in, pop the hips up and hold. I'm just holding this position. My butt is off the ground. My shoulders are pressing down. It's reverse plank. I'm feeling like a nice little stretch through the front body, and I'm feeling an activation through the back body. Good, good, good. You're so close, 30 more seconds. We've got one more action and a very short cool down. We're talking about a minute. Good, heels are down, press into the arms. Modification if you need it, you can always plant your heels into a nice little static bridge. Okay, your call. Keep going, we've got 10 more seconds. Flex those toes. Good. Breathe in. Exhale out. Three, two, set your hips down. Hug one knee into the chest. Lift the other leg up. Curl your head, neck, and shoulders. We finish with the single leg stretch. Switch, switch, switch. You're looking at your knees. Just that last minute of work. We've got 40 more seconds. If I wanted to make this harder, maybe I extend one leg straight and I move into a single straight leg stretch. Your call, right? Tuck your chin. You're looking at your navel. Got about 22 more seconds. So close. Really feeling the abdominals firing off. Working in good form. Chin is tucked. Shoulder blades are off the mat. Finish line for the work is at nine. 
Seven more seconds, low back on the mat. Four, three, two, rest. Bring those feet flat to the mat, bring them wide apart. Good, go ahead and drop your knees to one side and then the other, just a little windshield wiper in the back body. Back and forth, we don't have long, so we're just gonna kind of move dynamically. Last one, both sides. Neutralize the hips, heel toe the feet together, splay the knees out, take the hands to the outer, excuse me, the inner thighs and push down. Just nod your head right to left. And then we're gonna extend the legs long, reach the arms over the head, arch the spine, flex the feet, and then start to roll yourself up, 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 up. Feel free to use the backs of the legs to feel that nice little forward fold. Dome the spine, tuck the chin. Nod the head over to one side, nod it to the other, and roll your way up to sit. That, my friends, is it. I didn't mean to rhyme, but boy, oh boy, isn't that fun. Um, I hope you had a great workout, and I hope to see you next week like I always do. Get at me with what you'd like to see happen on the app and have a wonderful rest of August through the week.